Hello, welcome back to Photonic Luminescence. I wanted to show you this light bulb. But I remember that a few videos ago I showed you this self ballasted mercury vapor bulb. It's an HID light bulb, but it's self ballasted. Today I want to show you another HID bulb, the high pressure sodium vapor bulb. I'm going to talk about this and see how orange it actually is. So let's get started. What I really like about this light bulb is that it's my first ever high pressure sodium vapor bulb that I can well, have in my hand because I have seen but I never really had one in my hand to be also really mine. Now we have here the information that says Philips Master. This is a little bit blank over here and then we have Master Zone T Pia Plus 70 Watt E. So E27 says here. Long life, high efficiency, A plus. Now high pressure sodium vapor bulb can actually go to A plus 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 uh, three pluses. Really good. And then we have some certifications here over here. Really interesting. Yes, actually a little information does come out of the box. It's not really a box at this point, but I don't really have it right now, I have put it away. We have a sign that indicates you need a ballast and we have the E sign here and it does not operate when broken. The self ballast mercury vapor also doesn't work when you break it, the envelope. It's sort of like a safety feature. But anyway. Now I'm going to take out the bulb. It's just really this. And we have it. So, I really like it. It really seems like high quality. We have the E27 base, a glass insulator. Then we have all of the information being printed over here. It's really hard to do the glare of the screen. Then we have the R cube. And we have all of the stem and all of the things that hold it together. I really like it. I really think it's high quality. Now, before we're going to screw in and see its real wattage, I really want to warn. I'm going to use a 70 watt. Well, not high pressure sodium vapor bulb ballast, but a uh, no light ballast. Now the bulb is this was the original bulb, but I saw that the ballast has both. It says it says metal halide and high pressure sodium vapor. Bulb. So yes, it will, it should really work, and we're going to see how it heats up. It will take actually quite a bit. So let's get started with that. Okay, so we are going to see how it's going to warm up. And we're going to see. So I'm going to ignite it in one, two, three. There we go. Now, first, the. Well, it will first be this white. Or well, quite actually a bit. We are at. 41 watts and now it's getting really yellow this is really a sudden move actually and what I really want to know at this point really important is that this is probably almost monochromatic even though it's high pressure the thing is it's extremely yellow and pretty much everything like blue red it's almost washed completely away I can see this extremely slight hints of it you can see already that it's blinking while this flickering because we are filling a very high well pretty bright source and when this reaches its full brightness it will have like 300 no wait 3000 or so lumens and this is really a lot this will no 6000 lumens that's that's actually a lot 
again I'm leaving it so we are reaching almost 50 watts it's not yet complete we still need to wait because I will show you to verify when we are ready I have this box over here of this bulb and we see that it's not really blue I'm going to focus it here so this is not really that blue in order to see when it's really this needs to get a little bit more blue and it is just that I don't really know so we will wait a little bit but we are almost there with 60 watts almost so I say we still have a little bit wait but so the vapor okay I'm going to okay so we are 67 watts it's still coming up but I would say we have almost reached entirely its point so what do I have to say we have reached 70 watts the thing is that yes it's coming a little bit over but yeah there's some bars drop and so on so now the tongues around the paper is blue okay so that means that we have almost reached and what I really think interesting about this sodium vapor bulb is that I really think that it's a white one yes I'm not really that sure but white high pressure sodium vapor bulb they tend to be less orange or less pinkish if you want and more yellowish to white which I really can see I'm wearing sunglasses right now because it's really too bright I can't really look at it so yeah I can't really do almost anything to show you while it is blinking rather than a robot then showing you the wall but even then it's just so bright at this seven and you see the auto adjust of the my of my camera yes so this is a real yellow mixed with white a little bit of white so yeah now I'm going to switch it off and we can still see that it still lights up really dimly it's running by the heat the heated I won't really say salt, but I, it could actually be the ceramic itself, through that sure. after it's opaque. Really important, do not touch the bulb for quite actually a few minutes or it will burn your fingers. This thing is extremely hot. Now we have reached the end of this video. Before you are going to leave this video, Please give this video a like if you thought that this was an interesting life book. Also subscribe to my channel to be notified when I make a new video and leave a comment if you have any questions because I have questions for this book but now I have answered them. Also as a bonus if you stay subscribed and you will subscribe and like and or leave a comment we also talk about this mercury will be available, but that's next video topic. See you in next video. Goodbye.